Okay, let's look at connecting the KiwiTech drag trough to our, our water lateral. So we've got a hydrant um, set up there already. We're going to grab our, our trough lead. Um, now these troughs are supplied with a, a low density polyethylene pipe. Uh, the reason we use low density is because it's got a thicker, thicker pipe wall and so it's more resilient to kinking, which is important when you're, you're towing these troughs around. Now, the end of this pipe is, um, is getting pretty worn and so um, what I'm going to do is just, just snip off the end of that using a pair of pipe cutters. Okay, and you know, if you're moving the trough every day, maybe every six months or so, you might have to do that just to give yourself a fresh piece of pipe to go at, making sure that end is, is square. So holding the pipe lead in both hands, I'm going to take it over to our hydrant. One foot on the lateral, two hands on the pipe lead, push down, small turn to the right, and pull back. And you see the pull back, I've actually put both feet on the lateral to keep it nice and firm. If we look over at the trough, that's now starting to fill. When we're positioning the trough, it's really important that the, the float is facing downhill. And the float needs to be at the lowest part of the trough so that when the trough's full, it's going to stop the water and the trough's not going to overfill. Now these troughs are really good. Um, you're up to sort of a, an 8 or 10% gradient. Um, the, as long as the float is downhill, they're, they're not going to leak for you. So to, to disconnect, well firstly, once the trough's full, the pipe is under pressure and it's going to be pretty hard then to disconnect that pipe from the hydrant. If you've got a lot of water pressure, it's going to be actually impossible to disconnect the trough. So to disconnect the trough from the hydrant, you've got to make sure that the valve is open. So that means the float must be low and the trough emptied. So if this trough is full, I tip the water out, open up the valve in the trough, that releases the pressure in the pipeline. I can walk over to my trough lead, both feet on the lateral, push down, turn to the left and pull back. 